As you all know, the, every Fabrenia would begin with Rebbe explaining the significance of this particular day, this particular kvius, of every colliding component, the day, the week, the month, the parasha. And after a while, you know, listen to this week in, week out, because is it that important? Punct exactly the kvius from Kloli, says the parasha, it's the month, Nobody, no, nobody spoke this way. Look at all the, the Svarim up until the Rebbe. No one gave guns in the Biurim on the particular meaning, this unique, significant meaning of the way the Kvius is now. So the Rebbe is telling us and revealing to us every moment is real and alive. And it's a living Abishta and it's a living relationship and it's now and it's unique and it was never quite like this ever before. Like any relationship that's constantly evolving. There was a koch between the Bachrim where the Rebbe spoke and um, there was a special koch a few days later when, when the Fabrengen came out. It was a special, it was, it was a Seder Sichas. But then there was a Seder Limud HaAnochas to learn Vashe to know what the Rebbe spoke and also had an effect on us that when we went on with Tzoyim, and we spoke, and, and, and many things that the Rebbe said, we were able to give it over, and had the Rebbe, from the Rebbe's talks, the Rebbe was guiding us how we, the, the, what we should say, how the questions should be expressed, and the, the words that should we give over. So I remember that Friday when we went on with Tzoyim, the, we got such koiches from that sicha to give over to each and every one what the Rebbe said, and everyone that, that, and I heard it from other friends also, you gave over the, the, the message that the Rebbe said, and you know, you knew that when you're coming, when you go on Miftzoim, you're not going on your own. You go on, on the Shlichus from the Rebbe, you're a Shlich from the Rebbe to give over the Rebbe's words, Dvar Hashem. And, and, and they were, it was accepted by, by the person that you told him, and there was a koyach that the Rebbe gave us when he said when he said those words that we should be able to give it over. When we said lechaim to the Rebbe, so you felt that mamish that the Rebbe's helike oigen are looking at you. And this was like going by later years when it was bachalukas dolarim going by bachalukas dolarim, and and you knew the Rebbe is looking at you. And the Rebbe is looking everything what's going on with you. It was mamish like a yechidus. And I, I know come of a come upon him that that you needed to to have the right machshav and the right achlote when you said lechaim to the Rebbe, and then you were zoiched that the Rebbe answered you. A chaver of mine that, uh, tells me that once he said lechaim to the Rebbe and the Rebbe did not answer him it was Shabbos. And he says again, and the Rebbe doesn't answer him. Then he realized that he did not make Kiddush yet. It was Shabbos, he made Kiddush. And right afterwards, when he picked up his Kiddush, he said, L'chaim, the Rebbe answered, L'chaim, L'vrochem. When the Rebbe fabringed a, a Pashat, it was a little miscellaneous before the evening, but before the fabringen, but the Rebbe fabringed sometimes too late. And, and, uh, and it was, uh, it was no time after, till Shkir or after Shkir. Sometimes still myriv. So then, Pashat Kipshutoi, we ate through the Shabbos, Motzei Shabbos. So what, what I want to give you, t tell you from this whole thing, that Pashat, the Rebbe, by Fabring and Shabbos, took you to another world, and was, if we could say in a certain way, I mean, uh, uh, it was Hapshotah from Gashmius in a certain way, you, you were able to feel it. From time to time, the Rebbe surprised, and the Rebbe stood up dancing. The Pashat, so then, the oil was standing, the Milo Masorot for him, Pasha Kipshutim, and Gitanst. There was times that the Rebbe was Meramas, and especially the year of the Sforim, the first Sikhe, the Rebbe, the Tovshim and Vov, Shabbos, Chai the Rebbe spoke about dancing, and Mephazes, Mechake, Becholois. We understood right away that, that the Rebbe is going to dance, and the Rebbe stood up and the cheer, the Rebbe's Kisa Akodesh went flying, the, the elder sitting behind, were holding the chair. The Rebbe Pashat Kipshuto took you to another world. From the beginning to the end, the first Sikhas and uh, the, the Sikhas after the Maimur, there was the Rashi Sikha, the Zoyhar. 
the in in the summer there was a pikeovas the time of three weeks the base abhiro later from Tavshimem Dalad after Pesach the Rambam. And I I remember that after the Fabrengen, you felt Pasha that you know the world Legamre and it took you time to learn. Pasha Kipshutai. And in a, in a Fabrengen of the Rebbe said a mimer. So then Pasha Kipshutai. You felt in another world, you felt Pasha that the Rebbe hated the roof. Pasha, it takes you hecher on hecher. Many times, you know, after Fabrenga, we would Fabrenga afterwards. Why we Fabrenga after the Fabrenga? I'm feeling guilty, if that's the word. We weren't in it enough. Got distracted, strangulated. It wasn't there by far from a given. The Rebbe spoke and everybody sat there, you know, absorbed. Because in Avoid, they didn't push it to listen. Certainly, the Shabbos Fabrang is later, they're only on Shabbos. Quite tremendous concentration. Concentration, push it to hear and to follow. But more importantly, the Nafshi is to get concentration. The Dreb is talking to me, there's thousands of people in this room. About, who's talking here? My heart's that. The Nisham McClell is that. The Rebbe speaking, talking to me. It's very easy to get lost in the crowd, easier then than today. Because then the Rebbe spoke the Gashmi as he would say, 70, and then you couldn't see, the Rebbe couldn't see you, and that's it, your mind drifted. And when it was paying attention, to have this awareness that this is me, my Rebbe talking to me, this required achon and avoid and constant isbondedness and learning chsidus, which the fuel of this isbondedness. But again, today, there's no alternative. This essential truth is laid bare for us, for all to take, to be part of. We need only want to.